Hello, this is my 2022 Triumph Speed Twin, and today I wanted to talk about tank bags. You know, it's uh, mid-February in Pennsylvania, so itching to get riding again, and uh, <laughs> starting to spend a bit of money on what uh, sort of luggage do I want to have with this uh, motorcycle, uh, in case I don't want to keep having a tail bike, uh, a tail bag. The tail bags are useful. Uh, you know, you do have to swing your leg up and sometimes they distract from the look of the uh, bike. But, you know, what options do we have here? So I got these two magnetic bags from SW Motec. Uh, they have to be magnetic because there's nothing here to attach to this cap. You can see that, you know, you can't attach a tank ring versus the Yamaha that I have. You know, you put something here where these screws are, and then you lock something in place. So, two different sizes. You got the Legend LT1, and then you have the Daypack Pro Series, and two different sizes, as you can see. And I just wanted to see which one seems to fit the bike better, depending on the type of riding I intend to do. So we can take a quick look at what they come with you can see that you know of course it's rubberized and it does have this one a little loop system there's accessories you can put in and loop in like a cell phone holder same thing with this I think it'll loop in but because there's things here there's a different attachments that you can put on that as well uh, they both expand There's zippers at the bottom I like that this expansion point here has a place to hold the zipper in place but not a big deal inside you can see the room it comes with a clear vinyl protector that you can put on the bike in case you don't want to scratch your paint uh, if you do a lot of on and offs with it and it comes with a set of straps to hold everything in place a little zipper here to put things in so let's say you have you're going out it's cool in the morning you bring a liner well it's fit in there you take it off it gets warmer during the day so here's your little waterproof liner also may gives you a bit of heat maybe or warmth does it fit it does fit okay well let's put that on the bike I did clean it with my <laughs> cloth right before let's see right here seems like a good spot looks pretty solid and by the way this is what it looks like on the bike you know that's not bad that's not bad it's not a big bulky thing yeah that's the liner how about how about a water bottle suppose you're going out with a water bottle will it fit without expanding Ooh, maybe you gotta be careful you don't overpack things because then the magnet can come off but let's expand it let's expand it oh now we've got some more room with it so if, yeah no problem you can put something like gloves inside uh, it appears that you can put these inside and will it shut yes yes it will shut uh, and you can see here let me do it quickly now it's a little more bulky but still doable so the legend lt1 seems to be good for i'd say just uh going out during the day you're gonna have your liner or water bottle you're gonna have maybe chargers cables depending what you have in your with your bike not too bad not too bad the pro the day pack comes with the same protector comes with a rain cover you can see that it's going to have a little uh, clear spot so if you put an attachment here and you put this over you'll still see your phone uh, a lot more room a lot more room so obviously gloves uh, without expanding without expanding anything there we go and can I even stuck shove this in here let's put it on the bike there we go and it, it may fit without expanding. Let, let me do this better. Here's, here's that. Here's a glove. And this is what you get. So, liner, water bottle, gloves. I'm not expanding the bike. The bag. Bag. And this is what it looks like. So, a little bulk here, but not bad. The red accents look good on my color. Uh, 
it's solid on now let's expand it see what happens so oh it does give you quite a bit more room uh, this is what it looks like expanded <laughs> it definitely starts getting bulky now though uh, but you know if you look at the inside you might get away with putting quite a, a bit more in there you might get away with uh, let's see the, it's still solid the magnet's still solid mm -hmm. this may serve as an overnight bag as well if you're really skimpy on stuff uh, you know you're gonna keep your same riding pants and stuff like this maybe a change of shirt limited toiletries because uh, obviously you know you could clip your gloves with you and put other stuff in there uh, so yeah not not too too bad let's put it that way I love to think of uh, what kind of riding I intend to do in the summer uh, the little bag of course will likely do for most uh, but in any case that's the difference between the two bags, and I hope it helped. Thank you.